Hello humans, welcome to the local discard feeder channel where small artists, creativity, and originality gets the spotlight on this episode of expanding the discography music. We're going to be introducing the artist Blueberry Beach with their song, The Envelopment. Now this experimental, alternative, kind of songwriter, I almost want to say magical, kind of world creating artist has been around for a couple years and I think one of the first things that kind of stands out to me is that their musical production is insanely creative and uh, cool. And I think what's what's really, like they always have a lot of like synths or violins or like very or orchestral uh, music or choir kind of sounds that always kind of make it sound like it's, it gives off the energy that the album covers kind of uh, show, which are beautiful art on the album covers, by the way. And there's always the, the blue and the purple seems to be like spread a lot around um, their, um, their artwork where it's like a lot of like purple clouds or blue clouds and stuff like that. And it really gives like this magical kind of uh, feeling to a lot of their work. And I think I don't that that I've always that I find really cool where it seems like it's definitely an artist who's going in with the intention of kind of creating a world. And there's not always like lyrics on all of the songs. Some of the songs are just uh, straight musical, but um, it comes off as like an artist who's trying to create a world or trying to create characters. And you can kind of see that in their uh, music video for this song, um, Gravity, uh, where like the they're wearing like this um, purple and green kind of outfit. And then there's kind of like this other character in there too. And it seems like they're definitely creating character and world with a lot of the song, with a lot of their um, music and stuff like that. So I think that that is very uh, cool. The song we're talking about today is um, The Envelopment, which starts off with this really, really beautiful um, piano. If we're talking about the, there's two versions. There's the original and then there's the disassembled version. We're talking about the disassembled version because that one is, uh, they're both great, but that one is truly beautiful and also shows like an immense improvement in um, Blueberry Beach's um, like vocal capability too. And I think that even with that, with that improvement mixed with uh, their production uh, skills, um, I'm very excited also to see what they do next too, because um, the production on the first two albums were very, very cool. Uh, and I'm very excited to see how they've also improved with a lot of their, um, with what they end up putting out next, because I've liked uh, quite a few of the recent stuff too. Um, I think that this artist definitely has the brain of someone who is uh, insanely creative. I kind of uh, like it definitely, definitely has the brain of a storyteller and a creative person um, that um, I'm always kind of looking for when I'm looking for um, when I'm looking for artists. I'm always kind of looking for people who have a uh, very creative storytelling and almost like they, they almost put more color into their work, if you know what I mean. There's always more there's more color to their work. There is more um, imagery in their writing. Um, and stuff like that. And even the imagery doesn't just come from Blueberry Beach's writing. It also, the imagery comes from the music too, I think, which is, uh, very nice. Like you, you get the, you, you see the album cover, which already gives you a lot of imagery. And then the, um, the music gives you a lot more imagery too. And, um, this artist is also part of, I think, a very inspiring song, in my opinion, um, out of it, which you'll see is like their top song on, um, album music but um out of it is a really cool song which i personally find is uh very beautiful and it's also very inspiring for a lot of small artists i think because um it's a song with uh bruce Sterius and um isaac gordon isaac gordon being a much more known artist and having Bruce Sterius and Blueberry Beach on there with them created this really, really pretty song. And all their voices together, by the way, harmonize really, really well. They all sounded really, really good together. And it kind of shows what a lot of small artists 
can do when they're put together and it it it, it felt like a big um kind of like like cheering moment for really really small artists is which is like you can be like uh small but when you're kind of when a lot of you guys are put together then it you can do like a lot more when you're with a lot of other people and that song kind of felt like proof of that which I thought was very pretty and the song itself I I do really like that that was a song that kind of also took me off guard with how um how good it was it was it was a really really nice song too um so if you're gonna check out another song definitely check out um uh out of it but yeah, definitely go check out Blueberry Beach. Uh, definitely check out their kind of creative approach to a lot of the um, their their work and stuff like that. I definitely think that that is uh, their strongest point. There is really their creativity and their kind of um, world creating kind of approach to it. So yeah, go support this artist. And that's it for this episode of expanding the discography music. Keep supporting small artists, keep staying original, keep being creative, and above all else, have a fantastic rest of your day. Bye.